Yeah, I don't know. I looked it up, and it's saying that the third one is in the fucking the place where he was. Like which? I don't know. To does the rocks lower when they when I activate them? Yeah, the rock's lower, so... this lever oh how do I all right hold on <laughs> I see oh I see there is a... Oh, there it is. I saw it. It's behind that fucking curtain. Am I able to just shoot behind the curtain? Because that would be convenient. There we go. God damn it. God damn it, I'm a genius. <laughs> Just kidding. Thank you, Google, for telling me where the one switch was that I could not fucking find. Ain't somebody killed that fucking bounty hunter yet? Nope. And you're not gonna, you little bitch. Nice. Already read it. Adventure Handbook, Volume 3. Passes through the Shepherd Mountains. The volume contains several dozen finely detailed maps of the Shepherds from the Branching Spur to the north all the way to the El Castillo Desert at the eastern edge of the foothills. Passes are cleanly marked with helpful landmarks described for travelers. There we go, you little motherfucker. <laughs> Bank vault key. You're like human trafficking, huh, bitch? How about getting hacked up while you're fucking sleeping? Haha, <laughs> out on the ebb tide. Take down Shelby Cross and Copper Mountain. That's not, that's right, bitch. Bitch. Key to the prison cages. Nobody even in the cages. Like, why, why?
All right, everybody, let's let's get out of this bitch. Got my husband back. Let's get the fuck out of this bitch. The Great Escape. Get your spouse out of the quarry without ever alerting Shelby Cross. Seems I'm late to the party. Marshal Trogon. Took you long enough. Got your relay, Sheriff. Fun work. You, you're that bounty hunter. Unless I'm mistaken, I'm Marshal Trogan. Consider me a friend. Looks like you smoked out them Stillwaters in their trafficking operation nicely. Couldn't have done better myself. And Shelby Cross, you killed that flesh eater too. Only thing you didn't do is tie this whole thing up in a pretty ribbon. I'm impressed. It's high time you got home, bounty hunter. Any other loose ends I'm missing? Nah. Keep quiet. Well, these folks owe you their <clears throat> their lives. Hope you'll be content with a thank you kindly. Run on home now, bounty hunter. We'll take it from here. You're a good woman, a good friend. I owe you. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Wind's a lot colder now. I don't want to carry on, Jane. All this rage, Jane. Where am I supposed to put it? Justice has been done. Ain't no justice in it, Jane. Ain't no justice here. Hurt's gonna follow me, a ghost, long as I live. A hollering wind rolls across the graves. Your son might be gone, but you got your revenge. And saved your sweetheart doing it. Your sheriff friend won't soon forget you keeping her secret safe neither. Who said bounty hunters was scum? Justice served. Complete the bounty hunter journey. Took Albright's deputy along for the ride. Discover Mayor Weeks' secret. Liberate Quick Ben from the Stillwater. Liberate captives from Big Gulch Mine. Accepted Sheriff Albright's help to save your sweetheart. Kept Sheriff Albright's secret safe from the marshal. Sheriff Albright made it through alive. Killed the bastard Shelby Cross, ending the Stillwater's reign of terror. And brought your husband back home safe. 176 humans killed to date. Scholar. Read 50 books. And, hard to say, protect the sheriff and save the sweetheart, but who knows what it all means. We'll know soon enough. Your journeys are just beginning. Alright, so... Who are we next? Somewhere in the weird west. Cursed. Your new body will horrify all comers. You want to find out who you once were. You might have to uncover some old wounds and risk opening new ones. My wizard. The fuck is that thing behind? What is happening? Oh, 
Another soul for you, tree. Drink it in. Keep it trapped with the rest of these bacon slabs. And you, my brand new snout, you're a special case. The rest of you mud lovers, go on. Get. You swine smell like mud and shit. Know what's going to happen now? The world will treat you like a monster, exactly what you deserve. Now, Joe, get over here and untie our new friend. I can't stand this smell one second longer. Uh, this fucking lady, I, I ain't your personal pig spirit dumpster, get it? Of course you don't. Can't hear me. Nobody can. Wish somebody would just kill me and get it over with. This ain't no life worth living. Console the tree. Maybe you can help. Holy twigs. You can hear me? You can speak? I knew there was something different about you. That brand you got. I couldn't take your soul like the rest of these snouts. But wait. You think you can help kill me? It's all I want. I've lived a long fucking life. I'm tired, gassed, done for. I want to become mulch and say goodbye. That's the spirit. Snout, to kill me, you gotta burn my tree tap roots. Problem is, I don't know where they are. You're gonna have to find them on your own, you know, by walking around on your legs, which I don't have. Plus, there's something in it for you. If you kill me, then these sorry pig fucks can get their souls back. Wait, here comes Joe. He could talk too. Anyone knows where to start finding my tap roots, it'll be him. Y'all could fucking, I don't know, team up or some shit. Floods and brew. You talk too? Well, shh. Keep your voice down, else they'll bury us below ground. I saw the brand you came in. I saw that brand when you came in, sorry. I thought, thought there might be more to you than these other pigmen. We need to speak, but there's not. But here's not safe for dialogue. Meet me at my campsite at the center of Pig Eater Bog. Okay. Well now, let's see if we got this straight. A witch named Ruth who turns men into monsters. A suicidal tree holding the souls of all pigmen, and a talking snout who wants to meet for a swampside chat. That about the size of it? That sounds about right, yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm from Golden Age Fury. You can remember when you enter the life of a new hero. Can you see how Golden Age is developing your skills? <clears throat> Oh, empty, 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 empty. And, oh, no. Bullshit beer, bullshit, and bullshit beer. Alright. Okay. I guess my skills carry over, but, uh... My my awesome stuff does not. So I guess I'll just take everything because I'm poor. Stained bag, search barrel, what we got, fire tail, fire cocktail thing, whatever. Give it here. Pigmen brew. Meet Joe at Joe's Hideaway. Oh, what's this? Nice.
cleaver. <laughs> a cleaver, a cleaver. Oh, burn it Oh, can I... Can I recruit her? It's like showing her there. It's like a tough mercenary that I can... It looks like it's saying it's a mercenary that I can do something with. Fuck, no horse. <laughs> that sucks ass cheeks. All my good stuff. You, another talking pigman. Thought I was the only one in all of creation, but with the two of us, listen, we got a chance to take down Ruth's whole pigman operation. The Soul Tree talked to you? I'll be damned, and we gotta burn its three tap roots? But they could be anywhere across the land. Got another problem, though. Burn the tree, free the pigman souls. That's all dandy, but long as Ruth's alive, she'll keep making pigmen, sure as I love candy. <laughs> So, no more filler. As far as Ruth goes, we gotta find her and kill her. She'll be at her workshop, Canker. Can... Can... Canker? I'm guessing Canker, a secret place. You remember anything from... or from when they drugged you up and gave you a snout for a face? A room with five portraits. Sounds a bit flimsy. Pigment transformation is known to mess with memory. Listen, maybe this will ring a bell. It's a locket from before you had a tail. Could be important memorabilia inside a photo of somebody from your past named Cecilia. Locket inscription says made in Cedar Flats. Maybe the jeweler there will, will help you pick up the tracks. If you track down Cecilia, play the sleuth. She could help you retrace your steps and find Ruth. Say you'll kill Ruth with your bare hands for giving you a snout. Say Ruth's pigment operation must be stopped no matter the cost. Couldn't agree more, Haas. I got three tap roots to locate and you've got a locket to trace. Anything else before we pick up the pace? Ask how he got the locket. They brought a fresh batch of men through Dread Slough. You were in tow. Saw the gold around your neck and heard it sing. Flit, filched it, thinking I'd buy a new guitar string. Roots operation. Steals men in the night right out of their beds. Chops them up, takes the brain from the head, sews it to pig parts. And what do you get? Monsters like you and me. Abominations in pink flesh. The soul tree. Got all the pigmen's soul trapped inside. They'll never be free, long as it's alive. Ask Joe how he can talk. I'll save that story for another time, but it's the reason why I can only speak in rhyme. Uh. Then adios for now, Snout. Well, Ruth's pigman operation won't go down easy, but you'll sniff out that soul tree's tap roots. That locket of yours might lead y'all to Ruth herself. Better pay that locket maker a visit. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, I already read. Okay, don't even need it. 24th, vile monster Shelby Cross finally brought to justice. Boulder Creek Mine purchased by wealthy landowner. Investment funds on the local economy is recently promised to arrive at the town of Boulder Creek, where an anonymous buyer is offering to invest heavily in the local mining venture. A new site to be seen in town. Visitor and Rosella may amuse themselves with a brief and pleasurable visit to see the west's deepest hand-dug well. Constructed over the course of some years since the founding of the town itself. Red River Sheriff declares town safe from gangs. Uh, after much hard work from lockkeepers and citizens alike, the Sheriff of Red River have declared the hard-fought victory against the gangs plaguing the town. Outlaws of all kinds would do well to remember that they will not be welcome among civilized folk. Cattle death mystery solved. Following the gruesome loss of several head of cattle over the course of three or four fortnights, a local farmer says that the culprit has been found. A scarecrow, cursed of eldritch magic. So says the farmer had been coming on. 
Oh, I had been coming alive of an evening to seek out the blood of the livestock. Who placed this curse? The farmer could not say for certain, but ventured several guesses. This publication declines to repeat. Fuck yeah. The game's kind of, in the sense, like, roguelike, because you can re-travel all the places and stuff. But, I mean, I, obviously it's not a roguelite. I'm Personally, I hate roguelites. They're not my thing to constantly be fucking... Oh, let me restart. Oh, let me restart. Oh, this is fun. Let me keep just restarting. Not my thing. Cedar Flats, hmm? I don't feel like people are gonna take kindly to pig guy coming on through, but. You ain't welcome here, pig. Now get. Tell her, talk nice. Floods almighty, you can talk? Well, it wouldn't matter if you could spout poetry. I still wouldn't help you. Let me make this clear. I'm going to round up my deputies. If we see you again, we'll kill you, understand? Snout, I've heard of you. Heard you can talk. Please, my devotees need your help. One of our spirit halls is under attack. The witches, they're ruthless. They slaughter us, women, children. Some of the Franciscus werewolves are out there trying to protect our devotees. But I'm afraid it won't be enough. You, you're strong. If you help them, I'll help you in equal measure. I'll put in a good word with the sheriff so you can walk freely in Cedar Flats. What do you say? Agree. Please, there's not much time. They'll die if you don't move quickly. Alright, I got you, girl. I'm going to save the day. What are we at? A little bit more. Might be a horse you can steal. <laughs> Too bad you can't keep the horse. New bounties of attention, bounty hunters. Bastard Shelby Cross might be dead, but as the saying goes, cut the head off. Sermon two won't grow back right in this place. Crimes on the rise. All odds are feeling bold. Check the bounty board. Plenty of high dollar heads for the hunting. Okay. Uh. Oh my lord Magical toilet teleportation Ow You okay, buddy? Ugh! 
They turn invisible and shit. Oh my lord. Ah! Ow. Ow. Oh god, she got me. <laughs> yeah, Jesus fucking Christ, man. Oh, here's the very beginning of the game. There's 50 fucking dudes slicing at you and shooting at you, and yeah, good luck. Good luck, you dumb bastard. What the fuck, man? They're not even- they're not looking at me, they're looking at someone else, but they still fucking come and get me. God damn it. God- Oh my god, why- why don't you just reload- just reload the fucking gun before- beforehand, please. After you run out of ammo, just load it yourself, please. I'm gonna die again, cause this is dumb. Of course. Just crazy fucking assholes just running around with fucking guns. Fuck you. Give me some fucking health. You fucking dick. Where's health? Give me health. I want health. Vial of blood. I want health. Thank you. Yeah, I'm like, if I get shot, I'm dead. God damn. Hey, a snout, but all y'all do is, is kill, maim. Why in spirits would you save us? Tell the cleric you just wanted to help. Tell the cleric you were promised a reward. Tell the cleric you want. Gavin, be good. You talk. The spirits certainly work in mysterious ways. You have my thanks, now. Uh, my apologies. Old habit. My friends. Or my thanks, friend. Oh. Not what I was trying to do, but that's fine. 
Book of prayers. Oh, Lordy, no. Yebin and Nu, partnered spirits of the eternal cycle. Nice. Heal, heal, heal. Is there corns in this farm? Yep. Or potatoes, I guess. Potatoes on here. Oh, there's some corn. Uh, happy grunt. He's like, hey, pig guy. I'm just pig myself. Just pig me. There's a bunch of take whatever random shit just so I can fucking get some money. Right off the bat. Just a little bit of, a little bit of change. At this point, I'm just like, whatever, take whatever, take it all. Uh, is there a way up? Oh, maybe if I had the mega jumping power. <laughs> Alright. Save these people. Glad I can help them. Lots of candles. Bad dreams. I hope you can recommend something to ease my sleep. I'm at my wit's end. Keep dreaming about this orb, black as pitch, swallowing up the world. Think I'm losing it. Maybe some of your good chamomile tea? I'll, I'll try anything. Alright. Report back. What are we at? Oh, we at the time. All right. I'll save real quick. Uh, create a new save. Mm -hmm. All right. 